It's time to end my lonely holiday And bid the country a hasty farewell Dear Claire and I have been recording a tribute CD to our friend Richard Rodney Bennett. It's an orchestral jazz CD mostly of a number of his jazz songs as well as his favorite songs that he used to play. And it's Claire as his a former singing partner and me as his friend to piano partner at one time. It's our tribute to him. Here on the 27th floor I'm looking down On the city This year sadly marks the uh, 10th anniversary of uh, us losing Richard so it's timely and we were lucky enough to do this with the um, Royal Philharmonic Orchestra and a fantastic jazz trio that I worked with Rob Barron and Jeremy Brown, Matt Skelton. So we had all the elements that um, Richard had, which was he could straddle the classical and the jazz. You know, he was a real Renaissance man, wasn't he? Really? Indeed. Why won't you stay? I need to know your love. Is there a way? To make you show you love belongs to me. You smile in your sleep. Am I the theme of the joy you do? Have I made another sad mistake till I watch you away? 2016, I think it was, I did, uh, I orchestrated four of Richard's own jazz songs for the BBC Concert Orchestra and did it in a tribute broadcast for Richard. And so we had a nice start there. But uh, mm. then we went uh, from there to the songs that he loved to play and sing and it seems the songs that were most personal to him. Mm. And also it still amazes me that because I was his singing partner for about a dozen years, some people still don't know that Richard actually sings or sang and, and so um, singing a few of those songs over the last couple of days is particularly poignant because I can still hear him in my head singing them, see him. Mostly at the Pizza on the Park we would, we would do these songs. We went through any number of uh, songs from the trunk that he and Franklin had had written. He wrote over the course of his career a lot of jazz songs, and we wanted to pick the best of them and bring some mm. light to them, because people should know these songs, yeah. they're delightful. I think you'd be really tickled with the one from 1987 that he wrote with Franklin called Don't Play Games With Love, because uh, I wish he'd told me about that, because I'd have been doing it with him, you know, so it was quite a gem. I'll be doing that with my band. Don't tell him no when you really mean yes Give him the lowdown and don't make him guess It may be fun nevertheless starting point with most of these arrangements is to listen to 
his one, two, or three recordings of one of whatever, whatever the song it is, and and do takedowns of his particular harmonies and voicings. And he's actually the only person I ever studied orchestration with. So, you know, as I'm orchestrating, I still hear Richard saying, you know, if you're going to use the piano with an orchestra, just have it play really high or really low. Don't bother with anything else. And you know, he he, he was always about practical suggestions. I mean, he, and about clarity. You know, any time, anything that's not clear is a waste of time, which is a waste of money. Early to bed, early to rise. I greet the dawn when I open my eyes. Fresh as a daisy, as somebody said. How do I do it? I'm early to bed. Early to bed, up with a lark, out on a spree, but I'm home before dark. You can go disco and paint the town red. I'll take a rain check. I'm early to bed. I was really pleased that we were able to do a cover of I Watch You Sleep, which was the love theme from Yanks, the film Yanks. And uh, our friend Joel Siegel wrote the words, and Shirley Horn, who was Richard just thought was God on earth, did a really lovely recording of it. But it's not particularly well known as a song, so I'm so glad we were able to mm. cover that as well. Yeah, I agree. That was, that was an epic one, wasn't it? That yeah. one. <laughs> Hopefully we can do some concerts and do the music uh, live because I don't want to not do them again. <laughs> it was so nice. It's heaven. The last few days of heaven. Heaven. Why don't we take the car? Drive a bit, look at the view till we're sick of it. Sit in the sun till it starts to rain. Then come back to the city again. That fabulous city, so wicked, so witty. That fabulous city again. 